Hello and welcome to ProGreen TV. My name is Richard. Today I'm going to talk to you a little about adjuvants, uh, specifically a group called surfactants, more commonly known as wetters and spreaders. The use of adjuvants outside farming circles isn't as widely known as it could be, but they've got major cost benefits to the end user through uh, quicker results, reliable weed control, reduced operator exposure and less site revisits. So, what are adjuvants? Put simply, they're a substance that is added to a pesticide to improve its results. The choice of adjuvants can be bewildering, so we're just covering one group here today. But please see our other YouTube clips for more adjuvants in this series. Wetting agents and spreaders work by altering the surface tension of water, so a spray droplet doesn't bead up, but spreads flat so it wets a larger surface area of the leaf than normal. Wetter spreaders also help with the penetration of pesticides into the plant. The waxy cuticle or outer layer of the leaf, such as on this holly, is the prime barrier to spraying success. Modern organosilicon sprays cut through that outer layer and allow more of the pesticide into the plant. So, take this biosil. It's a product that we recommend paired up with glyphosate to tackle ivy. Now, ivy is notoriously difficult to spray and kill. Biosil attacks the waxy, shiny leaf and is able to deliver more glyphosate into the cutin cells of the vascular system where it moves into the roots and shoots. Now for the techie bit. Surfactants can be grouped as anionic, cationic, non-ionic and amphoteric. Don't worry, for our purposes the best, most suitable solution is non-ionic surfactant. It refers to the ionisation or electrical charge imparted to the molecules when they split. Non-ionics are widely compatible with most sprays as they're stable at low water temperatures, effective in low concentrations and they don't harm vegetation. The benefits to the operator are great. They show in a quicker effect on plants, improve rain fastness time, and better results on weeds, which allow for reduced dilution rates on some of the more common weeds. Spray adjuvants, such as Solar Plus, reduce evaporation and aid the transmission of the weed killer into the plant. It's ideally suited for grassland weeds, such as ragwort. So in summary, Wetters and spreaders increase the surface area of a spray droplet. More spray allows more herbicide into the plant, giving better results. They cut through the waxy leaf layer. Non-ionics are the most common surfactant. They give increased rain fastness, a quicker effect, lower evaporation, which lowers pesticide use. So, the choice of adjuvant is key and hopefully this has given you a better idea of what to look for. But as always, start by reading the label of the pesticide you wish to use. Many will list suitable partner adjuvants. Some can be quite precise in their recommendations and you risk making a pesticide less effective if you get the choice wrong. As always, please check our website or phone for free technical help if you are unsure. To see our range of adjuvants and other products, visit www.progreen.co.uk or phone our free phone 0800 032 6262. Thanks.